The decision for the transformation comes after 60% of its members showed support for the move during recent consultations. People, they don't care about what is happening on the, on the past. They want today and tomorrow, that's all. So that's why we said, for us to penetrate the, the, the young voters, we should try to rebrand this organization. Pensen Kashirijova, the Secretary General for the Youth League, is adamant that the process will draw new voters to the party as the country approaches the 2019 national elections. And there are people who say, no, you, you have to remove the color, you have to remove the name, uh, all these things. So it's a challenge within the party itself. So I think it's how the, brand, uh, the rebranding of the party we are talking about. The last time the party made changes was in 1994 when it changed its name from the Democratic Tunhala Alliance to the DTA of Namibia. The party has approached its supporters, of which 90% are the youth, to assist with the rebranding process. Reporting for the News on One, I'm Joseph Shifene.